Thermal Scientific Maxima First Strand cDNA Synthesis Kits combine genomic DNA elimination and cDNA synthesis into a simple one-tube workflow. Let us show you how it works. You will want to wear gloves when working with RNA samples to prevent contamination with RNases from your skin. To remove genomic DNA from the RNA sample, add the double-stranded DNA buffer, double-stranded DNA enzyme, template RNA, and nuclease-free water to a sterile RNase-free tube on ice. Mix gently, pulse spin, and incubate for two minutes at 37 degrees Celsius. After the genomic DNA elimination step, pulse spin and place the tube on ice. Now, proceed with the cDNA synthesis step. To the same reaction tube, add primers, DNTPs, RT buffer, and the Thermal Scientific Maxima reverse transcriptase. Maxima reverse transcriptase enzymes are exceptionally thermostable and allow cDNA synthesis at temperatures from 42 to 60 degrees Celsius. To terminate the cDNA synthesis reaction, incubate the mixture for five minutes at 85 degrees Celsius. Use the cDNA immediately for downstream applications such as PCR or qPCR. Or store it at minus 20 degrees Celsius for up to one week or minus 80 degrees Celsius for longer term storage. Eliminate genomic DNA contamination and perform cDNA synthesis in as few as 15 minutes. Try Maxima cDNA synthesis kits with double-stranded DNAs today.